Bradley Juby TV proudly presents. It's football time in Oklahoma. Welcome to the Oklahoma Sooner Football Vlog. The Oklahoma Sooner Football Vlog. Home of the seven time national champions. The most epic and brutal team in college football. The one and only Oklahoma Sooners. There's only one Oklahoma. How's it going, Jubitarians and Sooner football fans? This is Bradley Juby and. Woo doggy. That was wild and it. And like a lot of games that had me on the edge of my seat, but man, oh man, oh man, oh man. 2018 Big 12 champions, we have avenged the Red River shootout loss, the heartbreaker from October, and now we are Big 12 champs for the fourth consecutive time. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. And we did it by beating our most hated rival, the team down south, the old enemy, and I'm telling you, it was one wild ride, and I'm telling you, it was worth it though, because we are the Big 12 champs once again, and we are possibly headed back to the college football playoff. But uh, we have to wait the results of the Alabama-Georgia game and the results of the Big Ten championship between Ohio State and Northwestern. But, but let's get to the game. First off, I expect this one to be intense, but what I did not expect, though, I did not expect OU to hold... Texas to under 30 points. And then again, I guess the defense did step up a little bit. Not the way I wanted it, but, you know, it's better than 56 points. I'll t give them that right now. Oh, but Kyler Murray, man, I'm telling you, I think he may have won the Heisman Trophy with this performance. But first of all, let's hope uh, Marquise Hollywood Brown gets better. He was dinged up, but, you know, I'm not going to do a lot of trash talking on this one, because I think OU's performance speaks for itself, but I am jubilant nonetheless. I was in mourning eight weeks ago, but I'm in celebration now, not just for that, but also for the fact that my Broken Arrow Tigers won the state championship last night. So, I'm in good spirits right now. So, Kyler Murray, just touchdowns. I think he had maybe three touchdowns. He threw for three touchdowns. Um, I think Trey Sermon had a touchdown. I think Grant, Cal Grant Calcaterra caught three touchdowns. Either two or three touchdowns, I don't know. But, uh, I will have to tell C.D. Lamb, please don't drop the football next time. Please don't, okay? But, just when I thought Texas was going to get got the ball after that turnover and take it in for a touchdown and get the lead back, that blitz on Sam Ellinger and threw him right into the end zone for a safety. And then on that next drive, Kyler puts it away. Another thing, though, I think we only got penalized five times for 60 yards. Although I still hate it when they get a fourth down or a third down stop and they get called for pass interference. That really bothers me. But not as much... Because, well, we are victorious once again. That atmosphere in Jerry World was something else. Not saying that we need to play this game regularly, but it felt a little different 
But man, oh man, oh man, this was nonetheless vintage OU Texas. Vintage OU Texas. Two Mack trucks running into each other. But I'll get to the grades in a little bit, but uh, <sighs> yeah, that's my dog barking. He's going to be barking the whole time. Even though I just took him out, but anyway, I think OU did deserve to win this one. They got stops when they needed to. They kept Texas out of the end zone in the fourth quarter, which is awesome. You know, I'm gonna give props to uh, Sports Savant TV for uh, bringing up the point that Texas was not a good fourth quarter team. I'll tell you this right now: they did not show up in the fourth quarter. By that time, their defense was tired. Their defense just couldn't hold it. And their offense, by the fourth quarter, they just... The defense may have done the best performance. Because there was no way they were going to give up 48 this time. But... Oh, I might just go ahead and shorten this because, but I'm going to go ahead and just give you some uh, grades right now. Offense got an A+. I mean, I know they didn't score 50, but they scored enough to win the game. Although two of those points came on defense due to that safety. But Kyler Murray moved the ball like soon of, um... I'll give him the A-plus despite that fumble by C.D. Lamb, okay? Defense, I'll give them the B-plus because I think they earned it. This might have been one of their best performances. Yeah, it looked like they were going to wilt at times. And they did wilt a few times, but... They, they knuckled up when they needed to. That's what I've been wanting to see this year. Special teams... Um, they get an A+, plus, but, uh, and right now the waiting game happens, but I'm going to enjoy this victory. I'll have the, uh, bull announcement tomorrow. Until then, this is Brother Juice saying Boomer Sooner, Big 12 Champions.